Hey guys, what's up? It's uh, Shay from Electric MX here. I've just uh, had my shirt on for about two years, and unfortunately, uh, for maintenance wise, but fortunate for me as I've never had uh, any issues with the bike. I've just beat the shit out of it, changed uh, like four belts, and I've really never had a problem until recently. I was racing the bike, and uh, and it cut out and stopped working in the middle of the race. So. At the first round, I got second, and then at uh, this round, it was at Walton, and I was uh, getting my ass beat. My bike felt super slow. So then uh, I thought, you know, maybe it's the controller, maybe it's this, maybe it's that, but I noticed that my battery wasn't charging. It was going to like, it was sitting at 77%, and it wouldn't take a charge. So what I'm doing here is I'm gonna bypass my BMS on my stock battery here and see what I can figure out. So I was just gonna kind of show you guys how it's done. So I've gone through and removed all the negative terminals. I'm gonna re remove the positives as well and clean everything up and just have a look-see at everything. Uh, so all you have to do to remove this battery cap is there's these computer cables and they plug one into here, one into here, and then there's one coming from the battery as well. Goes into there, that's most likely your, your BMS cells, like I'm monitoring everything on your plus and minus, right? So. Again, uh, to get this battery cap off, all you gotta do is take these, get this crap off of here, kind of scrape it off. And then you use the Phillips hey, screwdriver. Have... Yeah, bud, what's up? Can I'm making a video. Some, make us some money. Can you make me some money pasta? You want, you want bunny pasta? You hungry? Yeah. All right. Mole, mole. Look what my dad's doing. Mole, mole. Making a YouTube video. Are you are? Yeah, it's right there. Hi guys. Can, can, can I be see? in the video? Yeah, can you see the battery good? Are you teaching? Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Hi, my name's Ron and I farted. Uh oh, you better go change your underwear. Look, quiet. look, guys, look at my arm. Weak. Jordan, and my. my... <laughs> Ronan. Do you guys know what this is? How many volts is this battery? 25? No, man, 60. Now I know, 60. Now I know. Yeah. It's 60. 60 volt battery. Is, am I right? Yeah. How, are, how the heck are you going to get this thing out now, I wonder? Don't worry about it, bud. You guys get out of it. Jordan, can you not touch that stuff, guys? Why? I'll put it back. Thanks, Ronan. All right. Are you getting some 100% shades for your brother or what, Ronan? No. Why not? He already has some. Oh, he's already balling? He already has some, Ooh, driver. You ready to ride tonight, boy? Are we going to ride tonight? Yeah. The screwdriver of death. Jordan, get out of there. So these are just a small PH1. To get these off of here, and uh, all I'm gonna do for my battery BMS, I'll explain to you guys what I'm gonna do. is very, very easy. The hardest part is getting me getting these off. The battery was marked from factory, but I added my own little indicators there so it I don't mess up. It was not from the factory. What's well, not from the factory, son? Battery. The battery is most definitely from you the factory. You are not from a factory. I am not from a factory. Nope. You got bit by a poisonous ladybug. No. It just landed on my finger. It just landed right here. A poisonous ladybug. Are you okay? Hi, guys. Jordan, can you point the camera up a little bit? So that I'm going to talk about this right here so you can see this right here. Oh. No, there's no need to touch that. Listen. There's no need to touch that. All you need to do is adjust this right here. Like that. What are you doing to that battery? I gotta fix it, buddy. Is it broken? Yeah, yeah it's broken. Sorry, let go of it. He said to hold on to it. 
Oh. I am a totally good cameraman. Can you see what I'm doing? And all I'm going to do Jordan, where you been filming, bud? What? I thought you were a good cameraman So with this I hope you guys can see All I'm going to do is That's my three leads coming off my battery They go into my circuit board And then they come out So that's all my BMS monitoring And everything is all in these computer chips here so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this single wire here for the, um, that goes right to the charging port, right? There's my positive and negative on my charging port, positive and negative. My, my positives are going to stay the same. I'm going to take this negative and I'm going to crimp onto here and I'm going to add three new wires just like this. Or what I could do is cut these ones and, cr and crimp them onto there. But I'll make my own because I got fisheye crimps at my shop there. So I'll add new fish eyes onto three pieces of wire. This is number 12. I'm going to use like number 10 or, or number 8, something bigger, right? Uh, and then I'll come off of here. And then I will just drop onto each battery terminal. And because, as I said, this is going into your BMS. And these three wires right here. I don't know if you can see them. These three. That's coming out of my BMS. So going in. Coming out. So, yeah, I will just take this wire and put it straight onto my battery. So that's just overriding all this battery battery jargon. All right. The, we'll see how that goes, see if it fixes the problem. What I'm thinking my issue is, I can see that this wire it was kind of pinched and it's kind of bent and broken. I don't know if you can see it there. It looks kind of suspect to me. So that's what I think is causing my issue. And that would kind of make sense to me why I'm going to like 75%. Two batteries charging this one this one bms is not not letting it charge maybe i i'm gonna i'm gonna have to see see what's going on here and uh yeah thanks for watching electric mx out